Hello there, welcome to a review from Mackey's, or as I normally say, hey up, guess what? Now I know what you're thinking, you can't be at Mackey's because he's on a, he's on one of them weird things where you don't eat carbs. Well no, I am eating carbs, I'm just reducing dramatically my carb intake. And I've decided it's in the public interest to review, after decades, a double quarter pounder with cheese limited time only limited time only so I've not had one of these obviously for decades and I'm gonna make allowances for this but only the bread is of major worry because it's got gluten in it as well not that I have an issue with gluten but I just don't like eating gluten so anyway there you go oh hang on what's that war ready uh, it was four pounds 19 pence so there you go, I've got your fingers stuck, there we go. Turn it round, have a look at it. It's nice and hot as well, I can actually feel it burning my hand underneath here. I don't know, it's hot. So, cheese is still a bit melty and stretchy, which is good. And we've got onions. So what do we get? We get some pickles, tomato sauce and actual onion as well. Gherkins, that's what I meant, gherkins. So, does it taste like ice nip? I'm pretending, by the way, I'm doing this live. I used to do these live, but I can't until I get a thousand subs who want me to do it live. Then make sure you uh, you subscribe so I get to a thousand subs so I can do these live and I can talk to you. It's like someone's had a bite out of that one there. That's a bit cheeky, isn't it? Anyway, basically, this is a half pounder uh, before it's cooked, obviously. Can in my body object into the carbs? It is very meaty. It's not as meaty as the mega burgers I've had from Burger King, which are like bigger than my head. But it's still a good burger. But it's really good. I should do this more often. Not once every 35 years or whatever it is. So what am I going to give it? Concept, I'll give it one out of ten. Mainly because they've run out of ideas, so they're doing stuff they used to do years ago. So the McRib comes back soon as well, eh? We all like to McRib. Cost, £4.19. That's really good, actually. I'm going to give it nine. And if you have a meal with chips, which I've not had, fries even, because they are full of starch, and that's the thing I'm avoiding, then I imagine it's going to be like £5.89 or something like that, which again is 9 out of 10, with a drink as well. Taste. Tomato sauce, cheese, onion, bit of gherkin, beef and bread. Can't go wrong, keep it simple. Nine out of 10.
overall, I'm going to give this 9 out of 10. I don't care about the one for the other one, for the concept of it. I'm just glad they brought it back. Mmm. Nice one, Mackies. What do I go on about the carb as well? I've got the playlist. It's not very pleasant, but there's a, a playlist there about me reducing my carbs for August 2019. I'm not completely not having carbs. I'm just not having them very often. I'm not having any potatoes at all. Uh, I'm not having any uh, sugary fizzy drinks. I'm not having any fruit with sugar in it. I'm um, just basically, for a month, just having a, a carb reduction. This is a bit of a treat, to be fair. In fact, it's a lot of a treat. So, there you go. The double quarter pounder with cheese is one of the best burgers I've had this year. It's really, really good. I wish I could have another one, but I can't. Does it say how many carbs are on this? No, it doesn't. It tells me there's 62 grams of, 62% uh, of fat for my day. 102% of saturates. 102% in that one burger of my saturates for the day. Uh, sugars, 12%. And salt, 49%. It's all on the bottom. So, it's a good burger. Don't have it too often or you'll die. You probably can't anyway, because they'll probably stop it in seven weeks. You'll have to wait another 30 odd years and you'll be old and fat like me. And then you'll be able to have it again. And you'll be like, oh, I remember when the fat guy in that car had one. And he said it was nice and he said it'd probably kill him and I'd probably be dead by then. So, yeah, it probably will kill me eventually. So, Thanks for watching. Uh, if you've enjoyed it, please subscribe. I need to get to a thousand so I can do this live. Tell your friends. Do anything. I just want to get to a thousand subs. But I want to do it with real people, with real uh, subs. I don't want to do it with that stupid buying stuff because that just makes you look weak and sad. So uh, thanks a lot for watching. Uh, if indeed you still are. Uh, and I will see you next time when McDonald's or KFC or Burger King do something exciting for another burger to review and give me a little treat on my carb-free-ish month. My carb-less month. Carb carbless month. My carbless month. My month of carbless I, I don't even want to call it. Anyway, till then, bye.